What's up guys, it's European Coffee Trip, we are back in our office. We came from Budapest where we spent last week and we would like to share with you in this video cool things that happened over there. Watch it. World of Coffee. As the name suggests, this is the event that is all about coffee and that brings most of the people, most of the coffee people to one European city. In this year, the city was Budapest. And this event is also very important for us because uh, I was attending World of Coffee in Rimini three years ago. And it was about the time when the whole idea of European Coffee Trip was born. And I get really motivation and energy from the people I met there. So we, together with Pradek, we really push it right after it. So it was really cool to be back in, in Budapest. And so it's, uh, it was full week, it was really <laughs> exhausting even, but we would like to share what happened there. And a big part of the event is actually Barista Championships. And there, there was happening five different categories. And what we are really excited about is that out of 24 finalists in these categories, two thirds of all the finalists came from Europe. So this made us really happy. It was a really successful event for European coffee scene. And Actually, the most medal went to Greece and second most went to Poland. So congrats guys, you, you are doing really well. But the most happy nation though was Slovakia because through Martin Hudak, they received the gold medal in the World Coffee in Good Spirit Championship. If you don't know Martin, he's the bartender at Savoy Hotel at the American bar. He's an incredible guy. If you have a chance to sit next to him or receive the cocktail from him, you will not regret. And if you have 10 minutes, watch his performance. It's mind blowing. And we are happy that he got his medal after so many years of competing. Next to the competition, there were many things, many things happening and it would take so much time to explain everything. But next year, this event happens in Amsterdam. So if you have a chance, go there, attend and see it yourself. And and the second part of the video, we want, we want to show you something else. And these are really cool things that we brought from World of Coffee. And yeah, let's start with it. Let's show you what we brought. So first things, uh, there was a Coffee Desk. Coffee Desk is a company from Poland that distributes and basically supports specialty coffee in, in Poland. But now during, the, during World of Coffee, they announced their their European wide shipping and the coffeedesk.com is now available and you can find really, really all the coffee equipment you, you want. And of course they brought really cool merchandise. So you get, a, you get a, the stickers, you get the pins, but what we found really interesting at their booth is actually this. Did you know that V60 filters can be in the shape of Swan? Is it was fun? It's fun. This was pretty cool. Like we didn't know. So we asked for one pack of these to brew our V60 in, in the office. Another thing is t-shirts from Victoria Arduino. So we were waiting for this t-shirt for quite some time. The reason is that, or I was waiting for quite some time because I wear small t-shirts and unfortunately for some reason they have always large and extra large. So. I'm really excited to wear this t-shirt from now on. <laughs> Another t-shirt we received is from our friend from Romania, from Vandalus Coffee. We met Konrad Altman and his lovely family during the, during the show and received the t-shirt that I was wearing for almost a week. And what, what uh, Konrad does is actually they distribute different tools for a Romanian market and it helps to promote the coffee culture over there. And by the way, actually he helped to design Baratza and our press website and all the materials. So he's a cool guy. And he also gave us this sick pen. <laughs> and of course we couldn't leave without saying hello to Francesco Sanapo from Vita Artiginale in, uh, in Florence in Italy. And as creative as he gets, they have a, cool new coffee socks. So we were telling you about the coffee socks before. So now we have one from made in Italy. What else do we have? And 
we already show you uh, one of the sponsor t-shirts, actually one of our longtime sponsor, not anymore unfortunately, was uh, Malkenic and we get uh, really cool things from there. One being the box of chocolates in the shape of grinders. And another thing, if you cannot really afford the EK43, at least you can have it next to your keys and maybe save some money to have it. <laughs> we didn't bring that much of coffee for some reason, uh, but we brought the special box, special box that we get from Alexi from Finland. And Alexi is the Finnish Brewers Cup champion. He was competing on the a, on a world level. And we actually remember Alexi from our first video of Helsinki where he was preparing for his very first competition. So we were excited to see him on a, on a world level stage. So we'll be brewing the Kenyan coffee from Good Life Coffee pretty soon. One thing I didn't tell you is that I was attending the Rico Symposium just one day before the world of coffee started and uh, even that gathers like really opinion leaders in the whole coffee industry. So it meant a lot to be able to attend the event and yeah, the Rico was full day of uh, lectures and, and talks from, uh, from various speakers and the one <laughs> particular one I, I would like to share with you is from Dr. Henry Bedler, also known as a hobby. And he's a, he's a scientist and he's very interested in the science of sensory, sensory. So he's actually a sensory designer and he helps to companies and brands to develop their sensory experience. And so for that reason, he was actually sharing the, the sleep max with us. And we were blindly tasting and following his advice or following his instruction and, and tasting different kind of uh, olive oils. So it was a different thing, like we are used to taste coffee or fruits and, and this was like tasting of olive oils. Uh, so that was the reason for having the, the sleep max. So this is uh, another cool gadget we brought. And, <laughs> and that's it, and that's it. Uh, we, and what about this beautiful? Backpack. Yeah, it suits more uh, to girls, so I probably give it to my uh, wife. And, but this was uh, basically, this is the bag we received. It was full of really cool things we received. And one of them were flip flops. Uh, yeah, so this is the, yeah, so this is a cool backpack we received uh, as, a, as a participant of the Rico. So yeah, like it. <laughs> So we hope you know now more about the world of coffee and if you attended the event so let us know in the comments what were your favorite things. We hope you enjoyed this video, if you did so smash the like button, subscribe and we will see you next week in the next episode. Thank you, bye bye. See you.